Turning our attention now to the ASX. Here's Matt Burney and Bulls and Bears with the latest public company views and interviews. Welcome to the Bulls and Bears small cap wrap where we break down the latest ASX announcements from public companies that are doing interesting things. Today's small cap wrap is brought to you by Neo Metals, ASX code NMT. I'm Matt Burney and I'm joined now on 6PR by the Managing Director of Neo Metals, Chris Reed. Hi, Chris. G'day, Matt. How are you? Neo Metals is a project developer that is sitting on an 80 six million dollar pile of cash from its last project a lithium mine near Kulgadi that it developed and sold out of the company has now invented a way of sucking nickel cobalt lithium and other metals out of old spent lithium batteries which sure beats trying to mine them I guess this week Neo Metals announced a plan to commercialize that technology in partnership with a massive German engineering firm known as SMS Group Chris before we get into that partnership deal can you just tell me a little bit about the lithium battery research Cycling business opportunity. For instance, how long does the lithium battery last for and how many old ones are out there? The lithium batteries and the transition to EVs is, is pretty much immutable. All the big volume car manufacturers are converting their production facilities from the internal combustion over to the EV and it then follows that the electronics giants are building all these lithium battery plants to supply the car make chain and, and so we can see them and see the runway out for the next five years and massive uh, increasing capacity that's going to generate a tsunami of lithium batteries because what we're even more convinced about is that these batteries wear out. Typically seven, eight years is a warranty period given for the cars and we're going to need to Mm. recycle them. They are just way too valuable to put into landfill. How does your recycling technology work and where was it invented? So we invented the technology here in Perth. Essentially what we do is we take production strap or end of life batteries and we've done it for car makers and cell makers and what we do is we shred it, we make it safe to then process it and solve and extract and recover the ingredients that go into the batteries. Big news this week, you've announced a plan to partner up with the SMS Group in Germany to get the technology to market. Just how big is SMS Group and what does that deal with them look like? SMS is a 130-year-old company. They are one of the largest builders of processing plants in the world. They are the project delivery partner and so what they will do is build and operate the plants on behalf of the joint venture and specifically targeting the European car makers. Outside of China, Europe is becoming the second largest hub for producing lithium batteries for the EVs. So Chris, I know you've done a study on this. What's it going to cost to build the full-scale plant when you when you get to that stage? Stage one plant is 66 million US dollars to construct. And what sort of percentage return will it show? The IRR is about 72%. It'll generate a pre-tax cash flow of about 50 million US per annum. Chris Reed from Neo Metals, thanks very much for joining me on the small cap wrap. And just remember, Bulls and Bears is only here to give you information, not advice, which you should, of course, seek independently. I'm Matt Burney. Thanks for listening to the Bulls and Bears Small Cap Wrap. For more public company CEO interviews, go to the money page at 6br.com.au and click the Public Companies tab.